great football team. We cheer the Pittsburgh Steelers. This is Anthony. And Ashley. Today we're going to bring you Ashley's famous Disney Hall. Yay! And you're going to also see a grown man cry because of how much money she spent. No. Yeah. It's not that bad. It's worse than you think, guys. Um, basically, so we're just going to go through everything um, that we bought. There's no rhyme or reason to this. I'm literally, everything is on a pile on the floor. And I'm just going to pick something up, unwrap it, and show you guys. Um, also, just so you know, this is not a video um, saying how much we spent or anything like that. This is just a video of what we bought and sharing how much it is only in case you wanted to get it and where you can find it. Um, other than that, this is not um, to kind of brag on what we spent at all because I'm not proud of it. <laughs> Nor should you be. But. Um, so I guess the first things first, we're going to show you a couple of things that we got that were free. Um, believe it or not, there is free stuff in Disney. So the first things we got that were free is our magic bands. Um, so when you book your, when you pay off your vacation, they send you these things called a magic band. And basically what this is, this is like your life while you're on property. So this is your room key. It's... You can charge things to your room on this. You open your door, um, anything. You get your credits on here. Um, and they give them to you complimentary from the hotel. So Anthony's is uh, a nightmare before Christmas and you can customize them. So I had, I call Anthony cello sometimes. Um, and that I got that written on the back of his. And then um, I actually got two but I don't know where my other one is. But this one was my Christmas one, and then I got this little bow on Etsy. So it's just a white one, and then I had this decal made, um, and I put it on. And then the other one that I have, and I, I had to pay for this one. So you get one free, but I bought this one. It was $14.99, and it was white, and then I bought the decal, and I bought the bow. So that was exciting. Yay, yay, yay. Next thing we got is refillable mug so also whenever you get a dining plan um, you get a refillable mug that's can that's free um, and you can fill it up as much as you want at your resort um, so I chose this one it's most of them are standard there was a Christmas one but I didn't like it um, this one has like the Mickey waffle and the premium ice ice cream bar and the balloon which I don't think you guys know but I have a um, Mickey balloon tattoo um, so that one was mine. I chose that one. And do you want to talk about yours? Sure. I got this one. It's the uh, Disney Skyliner mug. We I think we had to pay an extra ten dollars for this, right? Mm -hmm. uh, the nice thing is this will keep stuff cold for twelve hours and hot for four. Yeah. Um, I literally had ice for days in this thing, mm -hmm. and uh, I liked it. It was also $30 if you didn't have the plan, the dining plan, but you could put the $20 towards that and then from the from the dining plan and then pay the extra $10, which we chose to do. So we kind of have both. And actually, I think I might use this one. Um, I'm going to use it tomorrow for work. Um, just so you guys know, we literally just got back today. And I couldn't wait to do my haul so I could use my stuff because I've already started using it. She has. So... Where shall we start? Oh, here, I'll do this. Because this is kind of like chinksy, and I didn't pay for it because it was free. But I've always wanted one of these Starbucks mugs, club, or cups. Um, and it has like Tinkerbell and Mickey, um, the castle, a carousel mini, and his sorcerer hat. But I like this, so it says I Disney did. Parks, it. too. Oh, it does say Disney Parks. I don't know if you guys could see that. So. I really like that um, so I got it and all I did was I went to um, the front asked for an ice water and they gave it to you you can get free ice water so all right do you want to do you want me to do something yeah okay so we are in Epcot and a lot of you guys know I'm a Pokemon fan so this cost way more than it would in the store. This would be probably $4 at the store. We paid $7 for this at Epcot. 
And uh, essentially, the reason I bought it there is because I've always wanted to buy Pokemon stuff at Epcot. So this was like literally the cheapest, cheapest Pokemon thing I could find. I'm gonna do a video uh, at some point uh, entitled "Can You Make Money Opening Pokemon Cards?" So I have this pack and I have five Dollar Tree packs um, downstairs in my eBay shop. So. Uh, I'll be doing that probably in the next week or so as well. And what pavilion did you get that in? This was in the Japanese pavilion. This was in Japan. That was kind of cool in there. They had like Nintendo stuff and everything. Japan has like everything I like. Yeah. Pokemon, Nintendo, all the cool stuff. Yeah. Yeah? Okay. So randomly, let's just start. Okay. So this we got on the last day. We got it in Hollywood Studios. And every year we get a popcorn bucket and last year we got like a i don't remember oogie boogie i think um and this year let me take this out so you can really see it we got it's a santa alien Ugh, his mouth closes but yeah santa alien like strap them to you yeah there's like the strap and it has a bunch of different aliens on it and then his mouth opens for the popcorn we don't use these we just display them um when we got the popcorn we asked if we could have it separately so that it didn't go in and they were okay with that so and then there's this little pizza planet um logo yeah on his little santa suit so he was $25, um, like I said, at, it was like a little stand um, in Hollywood Studios on, Sun, on Sunset Boulevard. Yeah, and that's with the popcorn. It wasn't just like $25 for some plastic. No, it was, yeah. So yeah. It was part of the snack. Well, we couldn't use the snack credit on it. But either way, it was, right. popcorn is a snack. Yeah. But you might as well keep going because I have way less than you okay. so just something small we got so we always send postcards home to people whenever we go this year we bought them and we didn't send them because we didn't have time but it's just the fab five um so we're i'm just gonna be ghetto with it and put it in their bags for christmas um because we're not giving people their souvenirs we're just using them as christmas gifts so all right on we go so like i said we don't know what we're opening we're just doing it randomly i mean i guess the good thing is now you have a bunch of paper my mom's. oh yeah it is good one you want to do it sure i picked this up for my mom actually, actually we went two different ways and we both met up and we both had yeah, this Yeah, we both for had the mom. exact same thing. So it's like a Mickey award that says best mother. Mm -hmm. So my mom actually, we got her, it's like a Grammy award that says number one mom or something like that. We got her, it was I think our very first trip away, Niagara Falls when we first started dating. Yeah. And this, look, she's gonna be like a multi-time award winner now. Yeah, so. he's so cute. <laughs> um, That was, was it twenty nine ninety nine? Yeah, I think it was thirty bucks. Yeah, it was twenty nine ninety nine. Um, at Hollywood Studios, we and got it at Hollywood Studios. Look at all the good shipping supplies it comes with. Yeah, too. see, not all my buying was bad. You need to give me a bag that's just empty. Is it this they, bag empty? Yeah. <laughs> oh, shipping so. supplies. All right, let's do this. Okay, so. The last night that we were on property, I needed another luggage because I had overbought too much. So I went into this little side store. Orlando has all these little gift shops that sell like Disney stuff and whatever. And they're supposed to be cheaper. Who knows if they actually are. But I want, Anthony wanted to get like an R2-D2 little machinery guy, but um, opted out of it. So I got him a little piggy bank and it's big. And it's cute. What do you think of it? Yeah, it's cool. Yeah. And I'm gonna make her put it on her like Disney shrine. Yeah, I told him to do Star whatever he wants there. with it, but because it's a piggy bank. Um, but she he collects piggy banks. Wants to put it on my thing over there. So she collects all kinds of 
it, basically, if Disney sold toilet paper, we'd be wiping our butts with it. <laughs> so. So, in the same store that I got that, Anthony Loves Baby Yoda, I made a mistake because I have not watched Man whatever. Mandalorian. Yes. And I've only seen one Star Wars movie, and I thought this was Baby Yoda. Turns out it's regular Yoda. But I collect pins, and this is um, a Yoda pin, and it's 3D. His face pops out. And then I couldn't find a Magic Kingdom one anywhere, and I found this one at that store. Um, and you know that they're authentic Disney pins when the back of the pin is a Mickey head, a black Mickey head. Um, these were $6.99 a piece or two for 12. Um, so we got two. There you go. Yeah. You should keep them all in the bag, that way you can count how many pins you bought. Yeah. We can she thinks that. she only bought seven, but there's two right there, guys. All right. all right, let's check this little boxy. So, I don't know what this is, but we'll see. Let me guess, is it a mug? I don't know. Probably. She bought like 87 mugs down there. Not eight. We're not going to have enough room in the kitchen for these. Oh! Look, you should do this one. I might as well. So they were having a sale. And we're twinning. <laughs> they were having a sale on some of their mugs. They were $14.99. Um, so when I saw it, I could not pass up. Mike Wazowski. Um, super cute. I don't know where I got this one. Um, I can't remember. But I do know it was $14.99. And since I opened that box, I might as well open this box. You have so much shipping supplies now. I know. You're welcome. And it only cost me $3,000. Oh, okay. This is another <laughs> mug. This is Olaf. Yay! Yeah, and this was one of the ones that were on sale for $14.99. We bought this, um, I want to say Hollywood Studios, um, after the Frozen show. But, um, so he's kind of 3D. You can see there that he's popping out. And then on the back it says, do you want to build a snowman? So what that's, does it say inside? Oh, I didn't know. It says, I like warm hugs. So, that's my little Olaf man. So, those are that. All right. Okay. So, we went to a Goodwill. Might Anthony cannot go out of state without going to Goodwills. So, we went to a Goodwill. It was pretty nice. Um, There's but a video on the channel if you want to check it out. It's We Found a Huge Goodwill in Orlando, I believe is the title. That's simple enough, I guess. But as soon as we walked in, I took like five steps. I found something for him to buy, and then I found this. And I'm going to put it up as soon as we're done here after I fix it. But it is an official Disney Parks plat thing. It's like glittery, and it's supposed to light up. I have to get batteries for it. And Pluto is broken off. He was broken off when we bought him, but they gave us like a tiny discount and I really wanted this anyways. And this just needs a little glue. Super glue, it'll be good as new. Yeah, so I'm not even worried about that. But this was $49.99 at the parks. And I know because one, they were still selling them there. And two, the sticker is still on the bottom. And we got it for $5.99. So, I'm super excited. It has Goofy, Pluto, Mickey, Minnie, and Donald. Fab Five Christmas glitter, and I love it. So, I can't wait to put that up. All right. On to the next. Um, so, this, I really wanted one because I saw somebody wearing it. And Anth was like, go get it. And I was like, no. And I come back and Anth got it for me. So, I got a Porg. <laughs> porg, Porg. This little bugger sits on your shoulder, inside your clothing, on a magnet. Look at that face. So you can walk around, literally yeah. have a cord on your shoulder. So you can walk around. And actually, this was great for character interactions, because they would all, like, greet my porg. Porgy, porgy. She yeah. starts to put her I can't on. do it. But there he is. Little porg. So you just walk around and do your thing with your porg. So that's that. When we go see the Star Wars movie, wearing the Porg. Yeah. So 
So this was twelve ninety nine. I don't remember. Yeah, this was twelve ninety nine and Hollywood Studios, which I, if you guys don't, my actually might have been twenty. Oh, I don't know. Hollywood Studios was our favorite park. So they have a store down there. It's called the Disney's Character Warehouse. There's two of them. And they get official Disney Parks merchandise, 75 to 90% off. Most of it's like out of season, but they do get stuff that is still um, in the parks in there. Like there's a pin that I bought that is still in the parks at full price, but I got it in the Disney store for cheaper. But um, so we were there six times. I couldn't get enough. Um, and one of the times that we went, I already wore this also but I wore it yesterday at Hollywood Studios, is a Pixar ball shirt. And this is glitter, it has sequins, and it's super comfortable. Um, I got a size extra large, but it was $9.99 at the Character Warehouse. Love that store. If you go to Disney or Orlando, go there, it's awesome. Nala is inside of a double bag. It's like a paper bag inside of a plastic bag. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. Next. Sit, um, Basin is a soap store. Um, and every year we go, we get, I get um, a bar of soap because they make them with like Mickey stuff. So this year I got this one. And it's just like a cherry tree with little Mickeys on it. Um, and I actually have the two from before also that from last year I didn't use. And I bought this for one of, I bought it for my best friend actually. It's a scrub for your hands and it's so amazing. And um, there you go. And Basin has like this sink, big long sink and you can use these soaps. And she's not really into like Disney and doesn't understand it. So doesn't like princesses. So. Um, they had three princess ones and then they have this one. It's let it snow sugar souffle. So I got her that I hope she likes it. So that's my basin My basin my basin She always has to go to basin. I do um, Okay, so everybody knows I'm addicted to ears and the Disney character warehouse of course um, had some on sale and normally these are $29.99 in the parks but they were all their ears were on sale for seven ninety nine. So had to get every pair. Six ninety nine. Seven ninety nine. Oh. Okay. So I got the silver pair. And you wore that a couple times. I did wear this a couple times. Um, I wore it to Epcot to match my Epcot shirt, um, and I don't know what else. But these ones, which I absolutely love because teal is my favorite color. And the tag's still on there. And then I got the Rock the Dots, which I looked on eBay for these right before we were leaving, and they were even on eBay for like $25. So I'm glad I did not get them. But yeah, so like I said, these were all originally $30, but I got them for $7.99 each. Um, Okay, this is amazing. It's a necklace. I was trying to buy all the 2019 stuff, but they already got rid of it and already had 2020 stuff in. Um, so this was at the Character Warehouse. Saw it. It is amazing. It lights up. The whole thing lights up. You guys might have saw it when I was when we were in Disney because I wore it during one of the things. But um, I actually bought four of these because. One of them is for us. We buy these, we collect these. So we have an Oogie Boogie one. I think we have somebody else and then this. Um, but I bought three other ones for Anthony's nephews. So that's my little, this was $2.99. These were $2.99, originally $19.99 in the parks. So that was a steal. Could not pass it out. Photo album photo album. I was looking for one of these um, everywhere. Couldn't find one. They all said 2020. Walmart had them, but I was I didn't like them. Um, so I got it at the Character Warehouse. Originally 
I got it for $6.99. So it has the Fab Five plus Chippendale, the Castle, Epcot, Hollywood's, or Tower of Terror, and um, the Tree of Life. Why don't you hand me my phone so I can show them the next thing we got? Yeah. Okay, so I couldn't pass this up. It's a 3D Baby Yoda phone case. Had to get it. Normally wouldn't spend money like that on a phone case, but Ash pretty much peer pressured me into it, so I got it. Uh, that was $34.99. But, okay, I'll do this little thing. My Graham likes to color. So I got her these um, twistable crayons. They have all the characters on them. They were $6.99. They're cute, I like them. But I think she'll like them too. I hope so anyways. But, okay. All right. Next couple things um, we bought in um, Pop Century, which is the resort we were staying at, and I got a Pop Century pin. And this was silver, and it was not, like, they do their colorings, their pricing by colors. Um, silver was $9.99. And then I got a Pop Century magnet. I love the logo. Yeah, it is really cool. And this it was, was a good resort too. It really was. Um, that was six ninety nine. Um, every year I buy a park exclusive um, Pandora bead, and this year I actually got one at the Character Warehouse, which was amazing. But mm -hmm. as as you guys know, um, we have gone to Disney the last three years. But this was our first time on property doing it big. So... And going to all the parks. And going to all the parks, yeah. So I got a first... I don't know if you can see it. A first visit bead. And then on this side, it says... It's just the Magic Kingdom with some kind of glitter. It's not the best thing for it, but... Um, it was originally $70. I got it at the Character Warehouse for thirty-five. What about this other thing? So half off. Those um, were my birthday beads. Uh oh. I took them in case I was gonna buy a bracelet. But gotcha. So, all right. You want to do some? I can. Okay. Sure. All right. So, had to get me a Star Wars hat. It's really cool. Actually, I'll pop it on my head real quick. Um, just a really nice fitted stretch fit hat. I like stretch fits, so I got it. Um, it was nineteen ninety nine. Yep. Yeah, Which got, isn't too bad, I don't think. We got it at Disney Springs, and I actually got this to partner with R.I.P. My awesome Yoda ears, which she'll probably pull out at some point here. Um, I accidentally broke them, and I was so salty that they broke. R.I.P. Yoda ears. <laughs> she says she can fix them, so hopefully that'll be the case. Don't try. There is no try. There is only do. That's what Yoda says. Well said, Yoda. All right, me? Yeah. Or do you want to go again? You can All go. Right. I don't have that much. So this is going to be for his mom. She wears fanny packs, so we bought she her. She loves them. A Mickey fanny pack. And um, this we bought in our first hotel. So we stayed um, in a hotel for, for one night and then we went to Pop Century for six nights and then we went to another one. Um, but this was in our first hotel in the gift shop. They had a lot of stuff, but it was super cute. Um, and it was $11.99. Mm -hmm. But they had, I saw after we bought this, I saw these fanny packs everywhere. And they had like different designs and stuff so you didn't have to just get it there. But. Okay, let's see what we got here. I feel like it's Christmas. It, this is her Christmas, by the way, guys. This is, oh yay, it's my snow globe. I collect Disney snow globes. That's probably the chintiest one I've seen you buy. Yeah, and all it is is this little, it's like super cheap, but 
it's so cute. Nine, um, it was $19.99, but I got it on sale for $4.99 at the Character Warehouse. And it has all the characters, Mickey, Minnie, Donald, Goofy, Pluto. It says Walt Disney World. And then on the back, it has the castle. So I'm super excited to put this on my thing. Um, and it makes me happy. Was that the only Stone Globe I got? I don't know. So. I guess we'll see. Yeah. I would be willing to bet that all the stuff we're showing you, there's probably more stuff that she probably saw us packed away. Oh. So this was found on our last time, no, second to last time at the Character Warehouse. Um, it's just a Mickey's ornament. And it says Deck the Halls. It's glass. It was $27.99. Holy moly. I would never pay $27.99. But I will pay $5.99. Yoo-hoo. So, I'm super excited to put this. Nola has decided to start plucking at the tree. So now I have to put them up higher. But So that's that. Come here, Chloe. Let's probably stop. Sit down. And we'll get on there and play. Go ahead. Go play. All right, let's see what this is. Oh. oh, so that wasn't her only snow globe. It was not my only snow globe there. This one was so adorable. I got this in Hollywood Studios, and it was. Shout out to Tommy, by the way. Yay, 12, uh, $19.99. It is Sorcerer Mickey, and he's holding a snow globe, and the snow globe has one of the icons of each park. So there's the Tree of Life. There's Epcot, there's the castle, and there's Tower of Terror. And look at it. Super cute. I'm in love. I couldn't pass it up. Come here, Glove. Um, Pause that a minute. Okay, so this is Goodwill stuff that I got to resell. We still have a lot more stuff uh, that she bought for Disney, but this is uh, Tampa Bay Buccaneers hat. I said just picking stuff. Paid a buck for it. So, this is going to go in my eBay store. Okay. And I saw this. Well, actually, a lady was playing with it. And she put it down. And I was like, are you gonna? Are you done with that? You don't want it? And she was like, no. So, I took it. It is Minnie Mouse in this adorable dress with this awesome feather. This is like a plastic, very, very heavy plastic. It's really well made. I don't know what, who would buy or anything. There's no, like... I'm guessing it's by Disney. No, but there's no Disney stamp. <laughs> oh, there is Disney stamp on it. Yeah. But, I don't know. She was two ninety nine, which is a steal, I think. Nala wants to go outside. Nala's not allowed. Then, the other thing that we bought was... Actually, Anthony found this for me. But it's um, Epcot's Taste Your Way Around the World. It's Food and Wine Festival mug. That was and a good one. yeah, these are normally like fourteen ninety nine. Anth got it for two ninety nine. Thanks, babe. I'm like the best Disney picker known to man. Yeah. Only problem is I make no money off of it because it all goes to her. Okay. So Anth found these. They was they were at the character warehouse. Um, originally twenty seven ninety nine. We got it for four ninety nine. It's Sully ears. Aren't they cute? Beep, 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 beep. Sully's Sully. her favorite non-princess. He is my favorite non-princess. <laughs> so, then I bought these. These are kind of for Anthony, but not really. They're for us. They're Winnie the Pooh lollipops. Mm, is that what you were not showing me till the haul? No, there's one more thing. They're just Winnie the Pooh lollipops. I had to get them. I call him Pooh. He's my Pooh. So... in here oh these are my pins you guys keep in mind she's already shown you what three or four pins already two no simmer it down no nope, because there's no there's... no 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 simmer Wait, down simmer simmer hold on hold on, hold on. Uh, two i'm keeping track dude two yeah buddy okay so here's two pins right here yeah and three three pins okay. thus far so Got this. This is not an official Disney pin, but I saw it at Walmart, so I got it. I don't know. It's the alien. Yay. Four. Then, Hollywood Studios was our favorite park, um, so we got 
Hollywood Studios. This was nine ninety nine. Five. The other alien was three dollars at Walmart. Then we this was super cute. I'm, I want one of each park. So um, Animal Kingdom with Timon and Pumbaa, Zazu, and I think Nala. Oh Simba, yeah. Um, so that's cool. It's also nine ninety nine. Six. Nala, chill out, dude. <laughs> and then this is the one that I told you guys was in the park for $9.99. Um, I got it at the Character Warehouse for $6.99. It's the Lion King. Come here, Nala. With Simba and Nala. It says, can you feel the love tonight? Can you feel the love tonight? Then we, so we had tickets for Mickey's Very Merry Christmas Party. Um, it was on Tuesday night, but it got rained out. So we left at like 7.30 at night. Um, I ended up calling and they did refund us the tickets, which was like a little over $200, which is huge because Disney does not refund no matter what. They usually give you like another day in a park or a different um, event. But I told them we were leaving, we weren't coming back for a year and we needed the money back, so they did. But before that, I got the Mickey's Merry, Very Merry Christmas Party 2019 pin, and they had special merchandise um, for the party. They always do. And this was a fifteen ninety nine. Eight. She said she only had seven. So far, we have eight. So, uh, by the way, you can see that uh, that video of it getting rained out if you go on the channel and look up the video. Mickey's Very Soggy Christmas Party. It was very soggy. But Up is one of my favorite movies, and so um, the Grape Soda, if you guys don't know what it is, Carl and Ellie, they have it. Um, so I got the Grape Soda pin. It was yellow and um, $12.99. $12.99 was the yellow color. Nine. Okay, and I got another Alien pin. This one was at the Character Warehouse. Um, I actually did not see it when I originally got there saw it when I was walking out of line but I was the line was too long I didn't go back and I just couldn't stop thinking about it so I went back for it that was one of the six times she went so there's that it was originally $14.99 I got it on sale for $6.99 and then this last one I've been wanting for so long I've seen it on people's hauls and um, I couldn't wait to get to Toy Story Land so we could get it but it's the Toy Story Land pin with Woody Jesse Rex and an alien I think and penguin and it's so cute and I love Toy Story Land so much it was amazing over there and this was silver he can't wait to give me a final count on my pins and That's 11 right there. 999 so there's 11 and I'm willing to bet she'll probably find at least one more I won't right find now. more but I am gonna order so another thing wait what is this oh let's do this real quick I bought a cotton candy and with the cotton candy came this. It lights up. Lights up different colors, different flashes. It's from Maleficent, which, ugh, my favorite villain. Um, and it's just the wand, but it came in the cotton candy, so it was like the handle of the cotton candy bag. It was $9.99 for the cotton candy and this. All right, bags, bags, bags galore. I wanted every single reusable bag from all the parts. And she got them. I'm missing one, though. That's probably but, something. Do you have one in my book bag? I don't know. But Hollywood Studios is here. And then this is the back of it. It has Toy Story Land. Star Mickey, Wars. Star Wars. What is that? That is the oh the entrance, I think. But so that was tower that one. Tower on the other side. Oh, and the yep, yeah, Tower of Terror. Then we have Magic Kingdom is the blue one, and we have Spaceship Earth, Seven Dwarfs Mine Train. I think it's a small world, and Mickey again, and then the castle with the fireworks there. Then we go to Epcot. We have the Epcot ball. We have Mickey, the monorail, um, the World Showcase, 
and then Mission Space. We have just a Walt Disney World one that has all the parks, Tree of Life, Epcot, Tower of Terror, and Mickey. Did you get that one at the uh, Character Warehouse? I got this one at the Character Warehouse, yes. And finally, well not really finally because I have one more somewhere else, I don't know where it is. It might be in my bed. Is the Animal Kingdom. So we have Expedition Everest, the Safari, Pandora, and Mickey. And then here's that. These were each $2.50, but now I have them all. Yep, and the other one is just for... Star Wars Galaxy. Yep, Galaxy's Edge. Okay, here, Anth, I'm going to hand these off to you. Okay, so... <laughs> There's so many of them. I know. Just give me one of each. Yeah, let me grab these. There's a lot of these guys. These are um, soon to be discontinued. Um, I just need a Sprite in the water. But there's there's a lot of them here. Um, I did buy a set for a viewer, RC Maddox, better known as Mike. Um, so you will be getting um, this set as soon as you um, are able to PayPal me the difference for it. Uh, but I wanted to show you guys this. Um, so this is a Diet Coke right here. Um, it's written in like Star Wars language. These are what they look like um, at Galaxy's Edge. Um, I got this one that I lost the cap for. So what me and Ashley are gonna do is we're gonna turn this into a Christmas ornament for the tree. So that's gonna be really cool. We'll have a separate video where we're turning this into an ornament. Um, so stay tuned for that. But uh, that's Diet Coke. Obviously you have the classic Coke. Coke's the most uh, popular one. I bought a ton of the Cokes. Uh, Sprite. These are all Star Wars-esque. And Dasani water. So the water is in like an actual normal-ish style bottle. All of the pops though, well soda, wherever you're from probably, um, come in like the little like little globe looking bomb things. I know that there were problems with people taking these as carry-ons because they look like bombs. So Ash said that there was a lot of controversy over that. Yeah, you can't take those on the plane, like to carry them on with those lids. Mm -hmm. They can't have a lid. So, I don't know. <laughs> Baba. Staggers the minute he comes back in, there's chaos. Mm -hmm. All right, so we got this good. Ah, ah, Baba, ah, you want to come on the video? Come here. Come here, you want a treat? Come on. Come get treats. He said, I want a treat. Ah, ah, Trying to get his treat out of clothes ah, behind. Ah, All right, guys, the next item is this. This is a hat that I got at the Character Warehouse. It was on sale. Um, I don't remember. How much did I pay for this hat? $7.99. $7.99. It's the genie from Aladdin. But it was originally twenty nine ninety nine. Yeah, so it was a, it was a good deal on, on Senor Genie. And he looks so cute in it. I look so cute, guys. You, <laughs> you just have to see it. So at the Goodwill, we got Anthony found this Eeyore statue, which everybody knows I'm Eeyore, but it was three ninety nine at yep. the Goodwill and official so, Disney. Yep. 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 So, that was a heck of a find. Okay, so, let me get these bad boys out of the way. So, Starbucks has mugs. It's like the Where Have You Been collection, and they have them for every state. But, Disney has a special collection of them, and they have one in each of the parks. And so, I was on a mission to get each one of the park Starbucks mugs. Because I have a, a copy, a Disney coffee display in my kitchen and I wanted to hang each one of these so when I do I will show you guys what it looks like I'm not taking down the Christmas ones because I have Christmas mugs up there now yes they're Disney but for the first one I got this Disney's Animal Kingdom and it has all the major attractions on it there's Jumbo on there yeah which is hello in Swahili um so yeah, and the inside is green 
Um, and it's this. So for some reason, this one was the only one that was on sale. So it was $14.99. I don't know why. But. So, and then the next one is Hollywood Studios, which again has all the major attractions, Rock and Roller Coaster, uh, Toy Story Land, Tower of Terror. There's some popcorn, some lights, Star Wars Land, Starbucks. And then I believe, I don't know what the red's inside. Yeah, it's like a deep purple. But um, regular price, $19.99. Then we have, and they come in these boxes too. They have really nice boxes. And we'll probably use these for shipping. But this one is Magic Kingdom. This one's super pretty. But it has... Small World, Magic Kingdom, The Castle, Haunted Mansion, and then it says the most magical place on earth. There's some fireworks, Walt's there, we got a Mickey bar, um, and then on the inside it's just the sky blue. These will not be used for coffee, unfortunately. But, like I said, they'll be used for my display. And then the last one is Epcot. Which, for all of you, Epcot was our least favorite park. Mm -hmm. um, but, yeah. So, we have the monorail. I don't think we disliked it. It was Epcot just ball. not on par with the other ones. Yeah, right. In my opinion. Yeah. So, and then the inside is purple. So... That is the four Starbucks mugs I, and I had planned on buying these before we even left. I had my mind. I think there's a lot she had her mind set on. on. All right, here we go. I'm thinking this is a mug. And it is. Imagine that. Another mug. So this is the seagulls from Finding Dory, Finding Nemo, and they say, mine, 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 mine. That's what Ashley says every time she's around a Disney mug. <laughs> and they were originally $16.99, and we got them on sale for $5.99. All right. I'm trying to speed this up a little bit, because this is going to be long. Yeah. Oh, ornament. Um... So this was an ornament. It's kind of big, but it has all the princesses. On this side, we have Ariel, Mulan, and Belle, and it says nothing can stop a princess. And on this one, it has Pocahontas, Jasmine, and Rapunzel. Be the hero of your story. It's big. It's kind of like a saucer thing. It was originally $19.99. I got it on sale for $4.99. This is probably the other one for that. Probably. Yep. And you know I had to buy the other one. Imagine that. So, this just has all the names of the princesses written over and over again. And then this is all of the princesses. So, that's that. Love that. $19.99, but I paid $4.99. Alright, what do we have? What do we have in the field? Oh, cups. <laughs> More cups! So, this was on our second to last trip um, at the park at Character Warehouse. And they're just glasses, like drinking glasses. They're Christmassy. Um, but they look like this. They say like, be merry, be joyful, jolly, blah, blah, blah. They were originally $19.99. Originally. $19.99. We got them for $5.99. Hi, Bubba. There I have like literal, literally no room to put her stuff, guys. 
I was trying to put it all on the table, but now it's just going on the floor because we have no room. So along with the cups I just showed you, these are toothpick holders. Wink, wink. But they are, one has Daisy and one has Mickey, and they match the cups. These were $17.99. I got them for $5.99. I mean, I just couldn't pass it up. Yeah, because Disney couldn't market shot glasses to children. <laughs> They're toothpick holders. All right. Funny thing is, we don't even drink, let alone take shots of anything, yet she still bought them because they're Disney. I might actually put toothpicks in it. I don't know. Who knows? I might put toothpicks in you. All right. I got a 2019. Oh, this is going to be hard. Um, Keychain. Keychain. This was on, at the Character Warehouse. Shut up. Originally <laughs> $7.99. Um, I got it for $4.99, but there's each, I think it's each one of the parks. I don't really know what it is, but it said 2019 Walt Disney World, so Mama bought it. Is that for you or is that for? No, that's for me. Although I can't put it on my keys for work, so I don't know. All right, I'm thinking this might be a mug. I'm noticing a trend here, guys. It is. So this is Tigger. And it says bouncy, trouncy, flouncy, pouncy, fun, 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 fun. And it's orange. It has Tigger on it, and it's orange inside. They actually had a whole line of these. Like, there was Pooh and, and Eeyore and Piglet, but they didn't have any of the other ones. They just had hymns. So I got them. Here. Cat is on my Xbox. Yeah. Bubba, what do you want? Go ahead, baby. All right. <coughs> Bubba, come on. Treat. Come get a treat. You want a treat? Come get a treat. Come on, baby. Oh, wait, this one's yours. This is the surprise for you. Uh oh, there's a surprise for there's me. There's a surprise for him. It's not a big surprise. And it feels like a mug. <laughs> uh, imagine that. She got a surprise for me that's a mug. <laughs> Bubba can't <laughs> believe it either. Had her luck. Go ahead. Come here, Bub. You want a treat? What'd that got? Oh, which I'm not a the J. Do you like it? I do like it. That's nice. How much did you get this for? I think it was $19.99. You paid full price? Yeah. Uh, yeah. You like Aladdin. I do like Aladdin. The genie. Burner, burner. So I decided to get it for you. Ooh. And then... You ain't never had a dog like me. I got another mug. Oh, I love this mug, though. Another mug, guys. This is a 2019 mug, though. Tell me this is not adorable. It's so adorable. Like, it's, it's massively adorbed. This one was on sale for the $19.99. And inside it says... It was says, on sale for $19.99? Or $14.99. I was going to say, what a deal. Walt Disney World. It was on sale for $14.99, jerk. Excuse me. It's super cute. I love it. It's so cute. You know what's funny? Hmm. Being that it's 2019 and it's about to be 2020, mm -hmm. those are probably completely tank in price. Uh, are will, you going to take me back? No, but I will go yard selling for you. I got another globe. This is for um, a friend of mine. I didn't know what else to get her, so I got her one of these. So we will see. All right, clothes. Let's see. We're coming down to my wire. I got this sweater. It's 2019. It's long sleeve. This kind of looks quilted in a way. Um, at the Character Warehouse. It was. You guys ready for this? Oh my. $54.99. I spent $14.99. 99 on this. Yes, probably the best deal of the day. Wow. Wow. <laughs> disrespect on the 2019. That is not disrespect. So, speaking of 2019, <laughs> I got another shirt. Yay. 
and it has the 2019 everywhere and it has like the main logos of each of the parks plus it has the fab five um this was $34.99 i got it for $9.99 so steals and deals i'm telling you i saved you a lot of money so this i got for my little money. nephew he loves toy story and t-rex so it says totally awesome it says toy to, toy 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 with toy Rex. Um, this was 20 bucks. I got it for 10 so it was half off. Um, I got this for my Graham. She loves the color purple. I hope it fits her. I don't know that it will. If it doesn't, she's SOL. Yeah, but we ain't finna go return. it's just a purple Walt Disney World shirt. And I don't have mine, but I got one of these too, but it was gray and it had like a salmon color Walt Disney World. It was really pretty, but I wore it already, so I have it. Imagine there. that. And this was $34.99. I got it for $12.99. Okay. Oh. Do you know what this is? Oh, I'm guessing that's Nala's thing. Yes. Look at it. It's broke. Oh, that ain't right. Where's him spa? They're both broke. Oh. Is it in there? Did he tell us a broken one? I think he did, but did, did, oh I thought it I thought the name rubbed off already. Nala needed um an ornament and we had Hunter and Chloe we had theirs made. Um so we needed one for Nala as well. So we and the store that I had them done for Hunter and Chloe here closed down, so we didn't have one. So when we were walking through the mall down in Florida, they had one. So it's a little cat. Apparently his paws are broke. Didn't know that. Which is really upsetting. But it says Nala's first Christmas. It looks like his head's about to be broke. 2019. Too. No, it's not. Just his paws. And then whatever. I think something broke off of this. That's oh, it's got... probably his leg. This freaking dude just unripped us off, huh? Yeah. Hear that or it's just broken. It's in your yeah. luggage somewhere. Um, so these, I got their Beauty and the Beast dish towels, put them on the stove. We won't use them, they'll just go on there. I'll probably end up wiping something on them. And then he'll make me mad. Um, I don't know how much these were originally, but I, do, oh, this is embroidered. Yeah. That's nice. I don't know how much they were originally, but, um, they were only $4.99 at the Character Warehouse. Then, oops. On my Twitter. Yeah, I told you guys about these. These are the necklaces. Here. Um, I bought four of them. Then I got Edna Mode, a little plush. <laughs> um, I couldn't pass this up. It was $16.99, but it was on sale for $4.99. That's a deal. Uh, it's really good quality, too. So I have a stop. Then I bought this for my nephew. It's a Toy Story Buzz Lightyear Star Adventure playset. So it's that. It just opens up. There's a bunch of pieces and stuff to it. Um, originally $24.99. We got it for $9.99. All is in the suitcase. Yeah. Then we have these. We bought three of these for Anthony's nephews. They're lightsabers. Um, they're in packaging right now, but we bought each of them a different color, green, blue, and red. red. Um, so these were originally $14.99, but they were on sale for $2.99. Mm -hmm. That was an awesome deal. Yep. Um, and then we just have a couple more things. I got my Graham this notebook. She loves notebooks and pens and stuff like that. Um, but it has like all the parks and whatnot, and it's a magnet. So it was originally twelve ninety nine. We got it for five ninety nine, and then I got some magnets for our fridge. Um, I got these. We have Mrs. Potts, Lumiere, the plates, and the forks. Um, those, and then I I bought two sets, and then I'm gonna give my grandma one, and then we have the Mickey stuff here. Um, they 
were all originally $12.99, but I got them for $4.99. So, that's that. That is my stuff. Uh, you forgot the best thing that we got? Oh my, no. here we go. I'm going to save, save it for last, though, because oh. I have a few other stuff that we're selling at, uh, that we found to resell. I got a uh, Nintendo Wii bundle here for $15. Um, actually, no, I was number 15 there. I think it was only $12 because yeah. it was like 24 and a half off. Half off. So, yeah, $12. And I found it. Ash did find it. Yes, yeah, she did. I'm proud of myself. Yeah, you did good. Done good, kid. I got a few other things over here to resell. Ugh. Got Trace, three Bibles, pretty nice Bibles to uh, resale. I do pretty well selling Bibles. Um, Excuse me. So, these are good ones, nice condition and everything. So, those should sell reasonably quick. I've got an NIV, a King James, and uh, just a New World Translation. All, uh, like I said, in great condition. So, those should sell well. And for the grand finale. Bird. That's my drum roll. This is the absolute best thing that we purchased the entire time. Would you agree? It's pretty cool. We haven't played with it yet, so we'll see. But they Bird. should have it like secured in there. Check that out. It's a box. It is a box, guys. Chloe, you like my box? <gasps> Look at Daddy's box. This is a box. Yeah. I thought I got a box. <coughs> Nala will probably like it. Yeah. This is from the Droid Depot, guys. In, uh, oh, watch. There's something sticking out of it. What is sticking out of it? Oh, no. It's magnetic. <laughs> oh, That's a staple. Oh, yeah. So, let's open, let's open said box. Uh-oh. Nala, you're about to have a new toy. Yeah. This is going to be awesome, guys. I can't wait to actually screw with Nala with this thing. Oh, no. He's been decapitated. <laughs> Did his head come off? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, and it's rolling. It's rolling, 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 rolling. What? Why is his head not sticking? What happened? Why is it not sticking? Does it have to go on the other way? I don't know. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> so, we uh, custom built a droid while we're down there. Um, I will be releasing a video on the channel of me building the droid um wasn't too difficult to do mm -mm. but um you could either choose like a bb8 model or an r2d2 model um i chose the bb8 model um i don't know why i just thought it was cool that it was like a ball and it rolled um in hindsight the r2d2 might have been a little bit easier to screw with the cat with because it's easier to maneuver than a ball um, i'm sure you'll get it next year probably i was tempted to get it this year but yeah. I wanted to get this to be black and yellow, but they didn't have any freaking yellow, so I just went with white and black. I wonder if we can like, get, show them. But we named him AC2. Oh, you have to turn him on. Yeah, I have to turn him on from the inside. Oh. So, um, I'll, I'll probably, here, let me see. Ah, I decapitated him again. Off with your head. So this is like the actual motor. And where the heck's the switch at? Oh, I think it's up top. There it is. Wait, no. Boom. Motor is now on. All right. Turn on. It is. See light now? <laughs> you could have bought like some kind of a uh, chip to to. Well, what are you looking at, folks? You looking at me? <laughs> well, don't make him the exorcist. You can actually buy personalities for the droids, guys. Like, that's how, like, intricate it is. 
But uh, I'm going to have this thing like chasing all around the house. It's going to be so cool. Hold on, wait. He's already seen it. Oh. Oh. Nala's like loving it. <laughs> ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Nala's loving it. Oh. Oh, he's on the prowl. All right. But yeah, you, you can buy specialty... Uh, attachments for your droids there you can get uh different personalities for the droids it's just super cool all the different stuff but yeah we got our very own droid we named him ac2 since our initials are ac and there's two of us we bone them together so this is the love child of our disney trip <laughs> i have my very own droid his name is ac2 yeah and uh, we'll get your R2-D2 next year. Yes. Next time we go, I'm going to get an R2-D2 model. Hopefully, they'll have black and yellow by then. Disney! That way I can have a Steeler one. I name him PGH, mm -hmm. which is the abbreviation for Pittsburgh. So, that's everything we got, guys. This is my favorite part right here, though. I am excited about the droid. And you guys will get to see me pick him out and build him and all that other fun stuff um, as you stick to the channel. Uh, one other announcement um, that me and Ashley are going to make, we'll probably officially make it, but I'm going to give you a spoiler if you've stuck around to the very end. Uh, we're going to make a separate channel just for Disney stuff, and me and Ashley are going to do that together. So I think it's going to be really cool. Um, we're throwing around some names right now, but one thing I thought would be cool was Disburg instead of like Pittsburgh, like a little spinoff Disburg, but we're still throwing that around. Um, letting Ashley throw a few things around her head. If you have any ideas of a good channel name for that, uh, make sure you put it down below because eventually all of the footage we have for Disney is going to leave this channel and go over to that channel. But guys, we appreciate everyone sticking around to the end. It's it a long video. Yeah. Very Sorry, long. guys. Thanks for hanging out. Alrighty, guys. We'll talk to you later. Bye.